This tonight, a massive response in North Suburban Kildare for a devastating house fire. You see here, Skycam 9 was over the scene as the flames broke out through the roof of this large home. WGN's Patrick Elwood live in Kildare tonight with more. Hi, Patrick. Micah and Ray, good evening to you. The home, and it is a big one at that, is likely a complete loss. But the bottom line, perhaps more importantly, nobody was hurt. In the darkness that comes earlier these days, the flames lit up the sky for miles around this subdivision in Kildare. This multi-story home is uninhabitable and may be a total loss. The first crew was here within five minutes and found a heavily involved uh, house on the street here. Uh, during the dispatch to the call, we had uh, additional units coming already through auto aid. And when we arrived on the scene, we requested additional mutual aid to the scene and had approximately 15 departments uh, sent to the scene to assist us. The size of the fire necessitated a mutual aid response. Firefighters had to use what is called a dry hydrant system, where water is pulled from retention ponds in the area because there are no fire hydrants per se. The chief says given the intensity of the flames, the exterior side of one of the adjacent homes had to be drenched as a precaution. On the south side, we uh, were very careful to make sure we didn't have any what we would call an exposure and the neighbor's house was hit with water to prevent any neighbor's house, you know, catching on fire as a result of the fire. So most of the crews have pulled out, gone back to their stations in the surrounding communities. Uh, fire investigators remain on the scene, and so do the, the gas crews as well. Given the nature, the extent of the damage, I'm told it may take a little while to figure out just exactly how this fire started. We're live in Kildare tonight. Patrick Elwood, WGN News. Mike and Ray back to you in the studio. Thank you, Patrick.